Welcome to module three. This is a module that is all about job order costing. So we've talked about this before. The cost of any product is the cost of the material, the labor, and the overhead that goes into the product. And we said, look, material plus labor plus overhead, that equals the cost of the product. We've also discussed the fact that when you make a product, um, uh, say for example, I'm making a pancake, right? I know how much material went into the pancake. I know there's like so many eggs, the flour, I can determine the cost of the material. So I know the actual amount of the material. I also know the actual labor because I know how much time it took to make those pancakes. And I know how much um, I pay my employee that, that made the pancake. So I can figure out the actual labor cost that goes into the pancake. What's a lot tougher is the overhead, those indirect costs of making a pancake, the cost of uh, heating the grill, the cost of having lights in the kitchen, the cost of paying property tax on the house and the kitchen portion of the house where I made the pancakes. All of those things are difficult to determine. And so they have to be estimated. And our estimate, we actually say we apply overhead. So we call it the applied overhead. I'll just put estimated here in brackets. So this chapter, uh, the concept of applying overhead comes to the forefront. We're going to learn how to compute a predetermined overhead rate. Um, and so before the year, the way a company would apply overhead is they would estimate their total, oh, I'm supposed to say total, total overhead and they would divide by some estimated overhead driver. I'm just gonna call it the base. And they would say, okay, look, we don't know our overhead, but we know the more labor hours we have, the more overhead we're gonna have, or the more machine hours we have, the more overhead we're gonna have. So the base is gonna be something like direct labor hours or machine hours or something like that. And so each time they do a job, they make pancakes for a customer, uh, they know their material that goes into the pancake. They know the labor that goes into the pancake. They estimate the overhead that goes into the pancake, and they do it based on this predetermined overhead rate. So this chapter explores that concept and explores what happens at the end of the year when you've got all this estimated overhead, this applied overhead that's piled up, and your estimate is wrong because it's a guess and you, you can actually compute your overhead by the end of the year. You know how much you spent on those property taxes and on, on utility bills and things like that. You know how much you spent at the end of the year and you know how much you estimated. What happens when you get your estimate wrong? Well, that's going to be a concept that we explore during the problems in this module as well. So it's a great module. It's an interesting, challenging module. Stay tuned.